welcome to February 18th, 2008. The Lord Cares Ministry, a light shining from above, day 49. Thou art my hope in the day of evil, Jeremiah 17, 17. There be many that say, who will show us any good? Lord, lift up thy, the light of thy countenance upon us. Psalms chapter 4 and verse 6. I will sing of thy power, yea, I will sing aloud of thy mercy in the morning, for thou hast been my defense and my refuge in the day of my trouble. Psalms chapter 59 verse 16. In my prosperity, I said, I shall never be moved. Thou did hide thy face, and I was troubled. I cried to thee, O Lord, and unto the Lord I made supplication. What profit is there in my blood when I go down to the pit? Shall the dust praise thee? Shall I declare thy truth? Hear, O Lord, and have mercy upon me. Lord, be thou my helper. Psalms chapter 30 verses 6 and 8 through 10. For a small moment I have forsaken thee, but with great mercies I will gather thee. In a little wrath I hid my face from thee for a moment, but with everlasting kindness I will have mercy on thee, saith the Lord thy Redeemer. Isaiah chapter 54, verses 7 and 8. Sorrow shall turn unto joy. John chapter 16 and verse 20. Weeping may endure for a night, but joy cometh in the morning. Psalms chapter 30 and verse 5. A believer's evidence. Self-righteous renounced. Yea, doubtless, and I count all things but loss for the electancy of the knowledge of Jesus Christ my Lord, for whom I have suffered the loss, the loss of all things, and do count them but dung, that I may win Christ. Philippians chapter 3 and verse 8. On thee alone my hope replies, beneath the cross I fall. My Lord, my life, my sacrifice, my Savior, and my all. In God's word only do we trust, never in the traditions of men. His, a Philippian pilgrim, a workman for God, a friend of Christ. Brethren, do you want to have Christ in your heart? Do you want his Father in your heart? Have you been following his commandments, all of them, not just the ones you agree with? If you haven't been following his commandments, get down on your knees and repent. And if you truly want to, in your heart, to follow the narrow path, the Father and his Son will hear you. And bless you. Well, with that, brethren, we're going to close for today. You have a great day and a better tomorrow. God willing, we'll see you tomorrow. With that, bye for now.